So Clay, lots of things going on. Utah's uh, uh, set themselves apart that they're big into technology and the millennials are now making a lot of money, right? Big time. And technology is a big part of that because Utah has become such a technology savvy state and employer, we're starting to see a lot of millennials being attracted into that line of work, yeah. which is awesome because they're starting to make really good money. And now we're really starting to see them come into the home buying market. And that number is just going to continue to expand significantly. You know, last year, Jay, 28% of the home buyers in Utah were millennials. Yeah, that's crazy. Number one in the United States. That's really crazy. We beat out Miami, Houston, and some other major markets for that designation, but they're really starting to come in and see the opportunity um, that's right here in Utah. Yeah, and it's unique because they're, they have unique reasons why they're buying real estate because before they weren't, they were just, there was always a joke they're living in their parents' basement, right? Right, right. And they weren't buying real estate. They weren't. They, they weren't. weren't. But now it's because they want pets. It's, it's, it's interesting, more than starting a home or starting a family or marriage, pets is beating that out as far as a reason to get a home and get into something to have a place for their pets. And you know, it's interesting, there's a lot of bad information out there that they're being told. Some of them are still renting and they're still renting because they're being told from everybody, you have to have a significant down payment. This was interesting, non-homeowners believe, over two thirds of them believe you have to have 15 to 20% down. And that's not the case. What are not, we looking at? So if, if they wanted to buy a house, what, what are they looking at? Here's the crazy part. You can get all the way up to like, depending on the county that you're in, you can get up to almost $400,000 with little to no money down. Yeah. Very, very little to no money down. You can make a good income in the process. You can be making close to $100,000 a year. So there's a lot of opportunities for these millennials. And what we're gonna see is they're gonna start to become aware of that. Yeah. As we talk about some of these things more, they're gonna start moving a lot more into the home buying market. They said by 2025, so we're just talking seven years away, really, that there's gonna be 75% of the workforce is going to be millennials. And you know what that converts to? 75% oh, home buyers. That's crazy. So it is. It's exciting what's happening with them.